Hi guys, uh, this is day eight, and as you can tell, we're in a different environment. I decided last night when my ball clicked against my uh, gums down here, I was done. No more. I'm done changing the ball. It's down. The swelling is down enough that I don't care. Um, yes, this is bad. I know I'm supposed to wait at least two weeks. I've talked to a few other friends of mine with stomach rings. They're like, eh, I changed it after a week because I was annoyed with the two. I'm fine. So, what I'm going to do is I'm going to change it and then I'm going to carry the other um, barbell with me. So, the floor's wet. My husband just got out of the shower. Um, I'm going to carry the other bar with me because we're in town today and town is, you know, a half hour from base. And then if something happens to it, I'll just run into the bathroom and change it back out. So, and then I might have a few more days of blah, 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 talking. But as you can see, the song is pretty much gone. Okay, not a good example, but still. And then there's the fact that, you know, the tip of my tongue, top of my tongue, keeps getting completely rubbed raw. So, I'm over it. I need a bigger ball. So, in my pocket. These are the ones that I got. I saw these. This is what actually made me get my tongue pierced because I saw these. This isn't the one I'm putting in today. I'm just going to put it on all. Batman! I was so excited. So I have that one and this one, the Batman too. I put in this one, but it's flat. And I want to stick with the actual ball. So I'm just going to put in a black one. Only because it's acrylic. And I can stop clicking. Or just put in another metal one. But so Maybe I'll put a metal ball on top. That's what I'll do. Mm hmm. I don't know, I'll stick with this right now. Anyway, um, I just brushed my teeth and mouthwashed uh, before I started the camera up. So I'm going to wash my mouth out again and soak this jewelry in here. Sure. And this is, you know, what everybody uses, the Crespo Health, alcohol-free. It was nice and happy down and in your mouth. I'm nervous. I'm so excitedly nervous because I can't wait to get this thing out of my mouth. <laughs> Alright, so clean paper towel here. Break off one section down here so I can try that. Alright, so everything's clean. So no yelling at me. My hands are clean, just freshly washed. I'm gonna do it again though. Just because it because I'm changing it early, I want to be rather safe than sorry. All right. Let's see. Okay. Here we go. Dry it off. My mirror is right here. Okay, so it's on every well. And no, I didn't have the option of going back to my parish to do this. So I hope I can get it off. Ow! I stabbed myself with my own nail. Perhaps I should have cut my daggers before doing this. Uh, hate the taste of fish towel. I really do. <laughs> that ball's loose. You didn't see that. Um, Ready? Good. I'm going to do it really fast. I'm not going to play with my tongue because it is still new. Ah. Uh. Uh. 
The good black ball wasn't a good choice. Ow. <laughs> the reason I keep saying ow is because the bottom bar keeps stabbing my gums. <laughs> so much drool! Oh my gosh! Oh, that feels a lot better. There we go, and it's in, and oh good god, this feels so much better than the other one. The bigger ball, it's going to take a, probably an hour for me to get used to talking again, but oh, it feels so much better, guys, because I, um, a few videos back, I showed the giant crater in my tongue. Um, I had, sorry, somebody messaged me on Facebook, but I had a giant crater in my tongue from the ball sinking down into it and then trying to close around it. So right now it is sitting on top of the crater. So when I said ow, it was a mixture of that touching that and it wasn't painful. It was much like, ah, what was that? Um, the ow was the bar poking my, um, beneath my tongue and against my gums over there. But yeah, this feels so much better than that long ball. Oh my goodness. Talking feels fantastic. And I just made it click against the bottom of my gums. Didn't hurt. Yeah. Okay. Now I wonder where I put the bottom ball because I want to put that bottom ball on. <laughs> you didn't see that. Actually, you probably didn't. You just heard me go whoop. Um. So I want to do a comparison size here, like everybody else does, only because. Good golly, this feels so much different in my mouth. It feels so much better, guys. You don't even know until like if you are getting to the point where you want to change your ball. Please don't copy me and change it at day eight. That was a very bad idea, um, but I had to do it because I was in more pain than, you know, if I would have kept this in, I probably would have gotten an infection. Hold one second, let me grab one of these files. I actually have a metal ball one that came in that Batman set. I will do a haul pick, I guess you want to say, or a haul video of what all I have because I'm buying some more off someone today. <laughs> nice, nice friend of mine. She got her tongue pierced, her brothers are pierced, so she got it pierced, and she had bought the long bar, and then like 20 other um, random uh, acrylic ones, and she had the long bar in for two hours, but she's like, nope, can't do it, I don't want my tongue pierced, so I get a bunch of them for five bucks. Anyway, so, I'm going to do this in a way that, okay, well, first of all, look at the ball size difference, this is my new one. This is the old one, so that's why it feels so much better on my tongue. Mm -hmm. oh, wait. So yeah, you can see a pretty significant difference. Like it's a whole ball size there. Up. So yeah. Uh, there's still a gap at the bottom, which means my tongue isn't swollen. If it does start swelling, I'll feel it, and then I'll change it back, and I'll do a video going, I was stupid, I know. But for right now, I think this is a good choice. It's going to save me pain, and it's going to save me infection. So yeah, that was me changing my tongue ring for the first time. Ah!